Oh, yeah. You know yourself yeah. pretty well. Yeah. I think you're, you're good to go. Okay. Awesome. Wow. That's, that's on. Cool. That's all what right. I love to hear. See, when I first got in that, I felt it felt so much better. Like the, this part, just yeah. rotating. Yeah. I'm and not having to worry too. about, you know, um, Having to worry about wow, is my socket going to slip if I'm if, right. I, if I'm if I'm pivoting this way, right. or you know, playing golf, whatever it is, yeah. you know, and you're you're swinging like this, you're just yep. swinging the ball, your your foot's not sliding out of your socket. What I really anticipated with this level was simply a um, a better push off, right? right. Um, I knew it would be slightly better in other things, but I didn't the. Biggest thing that came out of you was, hey, when I turned when I changed directions basketball. really fast, yeah. it's locked on, right? Yeah, yeah. basketball. Yeah, but when I play basketball, I'm hitting, I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm turning. I'm yeah. not thinking about, well, am I going to slide out of my, or is it going right. to slip? Right. Because it can't, you know, in a round normal socket without having the fifty. It's made to do that. Yeah, it's made yeah. to hold yeah, on. Inherently, to the it's the flaw in the design, right? Right. So, so like this, I can't. See, I know I can't move that socket. Yeah. But I know I can move my knee. Yeah. See, I can move my knee almost out. Right. You look at where my knee is, yep. where my foot is. Yeah. In playing golf or playing any sport, yeah. you have to be able to pivot and not and not worry about, well, am I going to slide? Right. You know, and, right. Plus, and honestly, in playing golf, it actually straightens your ball out because now I know I can keep that foot in. Cool. And you swing and your, your foot's in, but look at my knee, my knee's yeah. out. I'm turned out. I couldn't run before my I mean, I, I, it feels really good. It's more similar to your own skeletal structure that you lost. That's the right. whole idea. Rather than having something attached to your leg, which is spinning and moving around in sometimes opposite directions from where you want it to, right. in this case, the closer we can get to osseointegration, essentially a direct skeletal connection, the better everything's going to be, no matter right. what you do. Right. right. We haven't found a bad reason yet. The only thing that is going to be interesting is how we look at gait from now on. We've been taught to, hey, they, they should be walking through straight, there should be no motions, right? But our own body moves. Right. It rotates in and it rotates back out. And we're seeing that with the iFi. Right. And and we're not we're not trying to dial it away anymore. We're saying well, right. let it be. Because you know what? Because some people walk like I duck footed. Yeah. Some people walk closed in. So right. I mean there's not one perfect way to walk. No. And your hips, some people's hips are different. Oh yeah. I mean especially the older you get, your hips might deteriorate a little bit. So you're 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 right. you're, you're milking your hip a little bit. This, for some reason or another, I'm able to stand better, and now I don't feel the pressure because sometimes you know I'd be standing for a while, mm -hmm. and I I notice I'm not starting. To feel I gotta start. I gotta sit. Yeah. And now I'm standing, and I feel I feel upright. <laughs>